Welcome to Fresh Bake Disney, the best of Disney Bake Fresh Daily. I am your host, David Erickson. There's my co-host right there, Sarah Romy. We're out in the uh, entrance to Disneyland. <laughs> trying to, trying to, ma I don't even, okay. <laughs> It's busy right here. It is it is bonkers. We just got here. It's Memorial Day weekend. Dude, it is Memorial Day weekend. Exactly right, Ian. How long did it take you to park this morning? Longer than I would like, but part of that's also because it opens an hour later. So. Right. No, no, yeah, I get it. That's The 9 o'clock opening is still just And the line I got into, there was only one guy working that booth. Yeah, me the too. The other ones were like clearly double, but the one on the far... One, don't I you mean, love it when you get in the one-man booth lane? And, but you don't, but you don't realize <laughs> it for a while? We were trying to see if we could visit... Uh, uh, Ariel, but uh, it's not happening. She just walked out. Anyway, it's crowded today. It's going to be a bonkers day. Uh, I expect the crowds to die down next week, but not this week. This week it'll be bonkers. Today, in honor of it being bonkers day, we're also going to call it. Hey, look, there's Snow White. Now she doesn't have a very big line, or does she? Uh, yeah. Is it curling? Is that what it's doing? Okay. Uh, today we, we decided we're going to make this uh, what we're calling a Walt Disney Day. You mean? That's Snazzy guy right there? That's Snazzy guy right there. Him? Yeah, that's, that's the actual uh, Walt Disney partner statue that she's got on her pin. We're calling it a Walt Disney day because what we're going to do today, our plan is uh, to do shows, uh, rides, things, the only things that you could do <clears throat> on opening day. Or opening two weeks anyway. So we're going to spend a lot of time in Fantasyland. And no time at all in Tomorrowland. Oh, no, yeah, because tomorrow I did open until... Oh, so you're going to say two weeks? Huh? So we can still do Casey Jr. then. If you're gonna no, get I'm going to say two weeks, yeah. Because if we want to roll in <laughs> Storybook Land or Casey Jr., because, I mean, how can you do a Walt Disney Day without doing Storybook Land or Casey Jr., right? That doesn't well, seem you're right. if you opening day, Walt Day, yeah. then easily. Hey, Storybook Land was pretty much open. It was just dirt. You could, you could go through the... Oh, hey, we got to look at this, don't we? We're about to have a Walt Disney moment. Uh, <laughs> oh, there's another one. There's another plaque we gotta go check out. Uh, so that's the plan today. Is we're gonna do. We're, it's we're gonna make believe it's opening day, um, and it's gonna be. That's why it's crowded because it was more crowded than expected. If I recall, is that right, Ian? Yeah. I'm not. I, I'm not up on that history. So they sold X tickets, and uh, X times three wound up showing up because of all the counterfeits. Ah. Yeah, so I think it's fitting that it's uh, a little bonkers today because of that. Although the crowds were more or less focused in certain areas and it was like a moving target. Uh, <clears throat> but yeah, I mean, it is, you know, it's, it's rather well documented just how too crowded it was on opening day. One of the things that we may get to do is this here horse-drawn streetcar because, well, it, the, the, the website I looked at it called it a horse-drawn trolley. Is that really the same thing? Is this a trolley? I don't know what the difference is. I'm not sure what the technical is. definition of a trolley is. I'm calling it. We're going to get to ride this thing today. Probably not that one. The next one is coming Not up. this one, yeah. This one's already full. Uh, we're going to get on one of those. And then we're going to go down Main Street and do a little this, a little that. Walt Disney Day, guys. I hope you are prepared for this because this is going to be a rather curious adventure because there's going to be a lot of things that we're going to want to do that we can't. Oh, look, there it is. Is that Reggie? No, that's brother. Yeah, brother. Reggie's brother? No, his name's brother. I know, but I like to think he's Reggie's brother. No, they're actually cousins. Twice removed. Welcome back, Christian. <laughs> you got one in right off the bat. I love it. Let's get on this thing. <laughs> I just found out why they know it's his brother. They're telling me that they've already been twice? Yeah, well, we're well acquainted. We did one whole lap. You know, if, back. if you were me, I, you would say we're not getting on this trolley today. Yes, Ian and I have already discussed the fact that you don't believe in things twice. No, I don't. You. This is also the same reason we didn't get on a nice train ride while yeah, we were, we're waiting for Thank you, thank you for that. Yeah, thank you for saving us. Because you ride. couldn't fathom that we would want to ride the train again later. Yes. Yes. I, uh, I arrived yes. about 30 or right 40 minutes later than they did. What's that? There's my ears. Oh yeah, so Sarah was wearing those pink ears just a minute ago on that young girl and she gave them, gifted them to that nice little young lady because you decided you didn't like those ears anymore? <laughs> I have a headache. You got a headache. <laughs> those are hard to wear when you have a headache. They're hard to wear, y'all. Yeah, yeah. And I'm like having like a good morning so we're not trying to like screw that up right, right. by digging a headache in, you know? Can't have a bad, can't have a bad morning on Walt Disney Day. Uh, but even Christian was like, but those are the millennial pink and I was like, I know. Blame the millennials. Sometimes you just gotta give things away. Yep, you do. Yep. 
You're only just borrowing it. Uh, so we're gonna do this, and oh yeah, so I got here like 30 or 40 minutes later than they did, I think, right? At least that. I've literally already had a Mickey waffle. I know, right? It's a fun job. But I didn't get my cinnamon hot cocoa. I'm pretty disappointed. Oh, hot, about that. wait, cinnamon hot cocoa. Yeah, it's like super yummy, and it comes with a whipped cream Mickey Mouse. Had carnation. But they had just turned the machine on. Oh no. And the woman was like. It's, it doesn't even look like hot chocolate. And then we were like, no, thank you. So no, okay. Well, can, can you get that to go? We could go to a job, I'm sure. They have the same thing? Not the same, but it'll suffice. It's hot chocolate, though. It's not like the coffee where you can get either Starbucks or that drips, the, you know, the... Uh, Correct. The Senka. cinnamon <laughs> Well, that's what I'm saying. You can't order a cinnamon hot cocoa at, at Jolly? I don't no. think so. We should ask. But did you know that the Jolly Holiday has a new treat today? What is that? Today? It's the pineapple upside down. It's a little bun cake. And it's fabulous. Are we going to try to call it a Dole Whip bun cake? No, he already tried calling it that and I yelled at him. They have a Dole Whip. It's pineapple upside down. Guys, just a reminder, please don't sit on these. And if you like that, please just face forward for me. It's pineapple How do you like that? Getting admonished by the cast members, huh? That's how it feels. I listen to them, so I don't care. <laughs> we're not gonna immediately then turn around and do the exact same thing. <laughs> and yell <out> again. <laughs> what? Huh? I don't think I'm trying to film huh? my friends. How can huh? I film my friends if I don't turn around? You sit behind them so that they're in front of me. Oh, I don't know why this is so hard for you. It, <laughs> looks, it looks better when they're behind me. Oh, this thing is moving. We have an attraction to film. Sorry for all that jibber jabber fresh baked. We're get, we were waiting for our uh, streetcar takeoff, our opening attraction on Walt Disney Day. <laughs> Is that Ken behind us? Those, no. those have been making me laugh so uh, hard. Look, oh, there's Pluto. That one, the
Ian, let's not go to d d the Star Wars land on opening day. No, it's not. That's not good. That, that's like, like one of the best idea. things that you've ever like said. That don't don't you yeah. yeah. Why does it smell like pizza? Smell like pizza? They had pizza on opening day at Disney World or Disneyland, sure. At 10 in the morning? Yes. Uh, People I'm love pizza. Fact check. Yeah, pizza. It's from the planet Pepperoni. <laughs> What's that Kalamata Olive Planet, the, my favorite one? I don't know. Yeah, no, I'm not going to indulge you on this one. Automat? What about Automat? That's the tomato planet. Automata Pia? No, oh, not. <laughs> hey, we're done. Let's go back down to Main Street. <laughs> what? We got business to do or take care of. We got we to look at the plaque. We got to uh, go to the Main Street Cinema. We gotta try to see if we can't get Are there. you literally making us walk back yes, down yes, Main Street? Yes. yes absolutely. Yes, is. Why can't we just can't ride we go, back down? Why because can't we these do cars. That's like over here. Show me a car that was here on the on opening day. Right there. Was that car here on opening day? On opening day, I believe. Is she gonna find out? Your man said 1957, Sarah. Man, he, he totally savaged that yeah, one specific. He, uh, he really 1956 broke it down. 1956 for the red one. I'm so the red, educated. The red right one now. was in 1956. Now, if there was a horse-drawn fire truck. We could take that. But there isn't. But what they did have in 1955 are these things. Uh, the, the tracks? Railroad trucks? No. Feet. I mean, they did have the tracks. <laughs> well, they did have the tracks, yes. I don't think my feet existed in 1955. <laughs> well, <laughs> we're going to pretend. And through the power of our own footsteps, through bipedal motion, we have made our way down Main Street again. What you doing? To all who come to this happy place, welcome. She's reading that plaque right there, Fresh. Disneyland is your land. Here age relives fond memories of the past. And here youth may savor the challenge and promise of the future. But first, we've updated our privacy policies. <laughs> That joke never gets old, does it? Is that the whole thing? No. Oh. Disneyland <laughs> is dedicated to the ideals, the dreams, and the hard facts that have created America with the hope that it will be a source of joy and inspiration to all the world. You mixed in a little British accent there at the end. I was just doing some, like, pompous <laughs> July 5th, July 7th, It's not pompous. This is the plaque that it was dedicated in memory of Walt's famous opening day speech right here. That's what she was just reading. Uh, and that's how, again, we're going to be starting our show this week. To remember Walt. Okay, I remembered. Let's walk down Main Street. For the 800th time today, David. <laughs> okay. Did they have sarcasm in 1955? Uh, yeah. I would okay. So. All right. I want to make sure we're keeping in theme. I don't want to have any non-sarcasm if no sarcasm is. Did they have video recorders in 1954? Sure they did. How do you think they filmed the opening day? Maybe not. But that was something. I feel that we. It's obligatory that you have to have your other hand up here cranking like this the entire say, time. It was the size of a Volkswagen, but. You know. I want to see you walking like this all day now. Hey, watch out for that Hitler. He's a bad egg. <laughs> Okay, run over! Oh my god, they didn't have one of these. No. Did don't, I already don't say film that? that? Don't know, stop. Oh. It does not exist. But it's very handsome. Uh, where we're heading uh, is uh, the Main Street Cinema. Because we haven't been in here in a long time. A long time. But the Main Street Cinema was here on opening day, except they didn't show Steamboat Willie. No way! By the way, in case you're wondering, we have a new. Uh, person joining us. Look at these fun posters. These are the movies that we're going to see. That right there, who I'll show you here again in a minute, is uh, our, our Twitter czar. That's Damien, our host of, uh, our, our Twitter host. Damien, say hi to the folks. Hi, everybody. Um, do you have anything that uh, you like to say to your friends on Twitter? Oh, yeah, I do. Yeah. Can I real quick? Yeah, go for it. Uh, there's going to be a giveaway. Oh, right. Awesome. Yes. So today is Walt Disney Day, right? Yep. So I have two VIP tickets to the Walt Disney Family Museum. Now, can can employees of Fresh Baked enter to win? Yeah, sure. Why not win? <laughs> what about family members? <laughs> yeah, maybe. Is that in the yeah. privacy policy? <laughs> <laughs> I 
but <laughs> all right. So what, 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 what is that? VIP. Oh, so have you heard the like with the plaid? Yeah. No, oh. Walt Disney Family Museum. In oh, the museum. I'm sorry. Okay. Yeah. All right. Yeah. So it's not owned by the Walt Disney Company, but it's all about Disney heritage. So from Walt I bet was, people would love that. Yeah. It is all the way till his death. So okay. have all Walt Disney history. Um, it's in Santa California. So and you've got two of those. I have two VIP tickets, courtesy of our mother and friends that I met through Twitter. Oh, right on. Yeah. Oh, so okay. So this is a uh, uh, what do you call it? Sponsored by yeah. Twitter, as it were. Yeah. yeah. Sponsored by Twitter. By so. friends of Twitter. I don't know when this video comes out, but when you're watching this right now, this video will air on Monday. This video, so yeah. hashtag on Monday. Yeah. So today, okay. Walt Disney, and that'll enter you into the contest. All right. If you're interested on Twitter, on Twitter, right. So if you don't have Twitter, you better make a Twitter, and then. And they should probably be following us also. Yes, definitely follow. And we could tell. Mm -hmm. Oh, I check. Oh, I check yes, check. Yes, yes, we know if you're following us. Yeah, I check everything. All right. All right. Cool. Thanks, Damien. Mm -hmm. Uh, yeah, so as we were saying, this is, this is what you can see today are all these little vintage uh, Mickey Mouse cartoons back in the day. I don't remember what they were, but they were like, they were just films, short clips of films that were being aired, I guess. I don't know if it's turn of the century or something around the same time or not. Or not turn of the century, the 20s or, uh, you know, 20s or whatever. Looks like Sarah's capturing some uh, videographic memories of the origins of Pluto, I believe. Yeah, Florida doesn't have this anymore. They don't have a cinema? I mean, they have the sign outside, but you come inside, it's just a store. It's just more store. I, when I went oh, last, that hurts my heart. Yeah, when I went in April, I'm like, oh, cool, interesting show. I want to see what's like. I said inside, it was a store. I'm like, but, but, but oh. where's, where's the six simultaneous screens in glorious black and white? Yeah. <laughs> in glorious black and white. Oh, they're doing a uh, Walk in Walt's footsteps tour, I think. Yeah, so you've got uh, the polo match here. Walt was a big fan of polo. He tried to uh, get into that, as an, and then he wind up burning his back. I think I've talked about this before. Is that Clark Gable? I think that's Clark Gable. Uh, tire Troubles, I think. Tire Troubles. This is the introduction of Donald, if I'm not mistaken, where Donald was a friendly fella and a police duck. Trying to get good old or bad old Pete. You know, a lot of what you see here wasn't here either. Those trees, these uh, the, the gas lights, the, the lamp, whatever you call those gas lamps. Uh, gas light. <laughs> gas lighting wasn't a thing back in the 50s either, I don't think. Well, maybe it was. They didn't have they a name for it. They made that term, but yeah. that act, that act, yeah. Uh, and then Damien reminded me that uh, what definitely was here in 1955 was uh, custodial cast members. That was the first, uh, he said that was the very first position that uh, Walt created. Look and at all these trash cans. Yeah, he made a point of saying there needs to be a trash can every it's X feet. feet. Yeah, every, so you didn't have to go very far so that there would be no trash on the ground. You didn't want anybody to ever be Didn't want anybody to like, to, to not know where a trash can was and just leave their stuff where they were, which... That's why it especially drives me nuts to see trash sitting at Disneyland. Right. It's not like you can't... How you could be that possibly everywhere. lazy that you can't just hold on to your Look at, trash. I can see eight of them just in my current field of vision. It's true. Right? Without turning my head, I'm a Without even, right, in my current field of vision, I, it's probably more than that, actually, if I stop and look, if we freeze frame. Hey, I have a great idea as part of... Uh, uh, Walt Day. Count how many trash cans there are this week? No, no. Let's go to Tomorrowland. <laughs> what do you mean? There is no Tomorrowland on opening. What's yeah. Tomorrowland? <laughs> we, if you run down the list of attractions that were open on, in Tomorrowland, it's like the Hall of Chemistry and the the what well, the mission the Hall of Aluminum. Hall the Aluminum, yeah. Uh, <clears throat> The, uh, they had that Circarama thing was open, but they can't do that. I wish that would be kind of neat. You, can, you know what? If you want to see Circarama, go to Walt Disney World. They got a bunch of them at Epcot. Ep Epcot has, I want to say, two Circle Vision. I feel like every time I hear the word Epcot, I want to say it like Walt does. Which is what? Epcot. Ah. <laughs> he would always enunciate the cot for some reason. We're going to take a picture here of uh, a thing that wasn't here in 1955. The statue didn't get here till like, I want to say the 80s, early 80s maybe. But I thought it would be cool. It'd make for a good thumbnail, don't you think, Sarah? 
Look guys, they've got two photo pass photographers going. I love how uh, when you when you get home and you look at your picture, you feel like you're the only person in that scene. But when you're actually here, there's a thousand people. Oh wait, I need to get in on this, don't I? We've got lots more videos for you to see, so grab a churro and check out some of our other videos and have your mind blown by how much fun we're having. We truly are the best of Disney Bake Fresh Daily. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel. We'll see you next time. Fresh Baked!